Hello, you are welcome to solve this math problem, which is 8 power x plus 27 power x over 12 power x plus 18 power x is equal to 7 over 6. To find the values of x from this equation. Now, from here, 8 power x, 8 into exponent, 8 is same as 2 power 3. Then bracket this power of x plus 27, 27 is same as 3 power 3, then bracket this power of x, then over, from here 12, 12 is same as 4 times 3, now 4 to have base of 2, 4 is same as 2 square, then times 3, then bracket this power of x plus 18, 18 is same as 2 times 9, so it will be 2 times 9 is same as 3 square. Then bracket this power of x is equal to 7 over 6. Then in the next step, from here we'll exchange these powers. Here we'll exchange the powers by applying exponential rule, which is a power of m bracket power of n is equal to a power of m times n is m n is equal to a power of n inside power of m outside. So a power of n bracket power of m outside the bracket. So we'll apply this exponential rule. Then from this part here, we'll take power of x inside power of 3 outside. So it will be 2 power of x bracket power of 3 outside the bracket. Plus here, we'll take power of x inside power of 3 outside. So it will be 3 power of x bracket power of 3 outside the bracket. Then over, from here we'll take power of x inside, so it will be 2 power of 2x. Then here it is in this form, then we'll take to this form, so it will be 2 power of x here, power of x we'll take inside the bracket, power of 2 we'll take outside the bracket. Then times, from here we'll take this power of x inside, so it will be 2 power of x, so here, I mean 3 power of x, then plus, from here, we'll take this power of x inside, so to be 2 power of x, so here, 2 power of x times, here, we'll take this power of x inside, so to be 3 power of 2x, which is in this form, then we'll take to this form, so to be 3 power of x inside the bracket, bracket power of 3, I mean, this power of 2, sorry, this power of 2 outside the bracket is equal to 7 over 6. Now, from this equation here, we can see this 2 power of x, 2 power of x, 2 power of x is common. So, we will let a is equal to 2 power of x and b is equal to this 3 power of x here, which is common. So, 3 power of x. Then, our equation, it will be, this is a, it will be a power of 3. So, here, it will be a power of 3 plus b power of 3 then over a square times this is b so it will be a square times b then plus this here a it will be a times b square so a b square is equal to 7 over 6 then in the next step from here a power of 3 plus b power of 3 this is in the form of a perfect cube so this here, it is same as a plus b bracket bracket a square minus a b plus b square bracket then over from the denominator here a square plus b a square b plus a b square a b is common so we'll take out of bracket so a square b divided by a b it is a plus a b square divided by a b it is b bracket is equal to 7 over 6 now from here to simplify this a plus b will cancel this a plus b so it will be this which is a square minus a b plus b square then over a b is equal to 7 over 6 then from here, we'll cross multiply. So it will be 6 times.
times this so 6 times a square it is 6 a square 6 times minus a b it will be minus 6 a b then plus 6 times b square is 6 b square is equal to 7 times a b is 7 a b then in the next step we'll take this 7 a b to the left side so it will be this which is 6 a square minus 6 a b this will take to this side will be minus 7 a b then plus 6 b square is equal to 0 then in the next step from here it will be 6 a square minus 6 a b minus 7 a b to be minus 13 a b then plus 6 b square is equal to 0 then from here we'll make in form of a quadratic equation so from here this b square in both sides will multiply by to cancel this b square so we'll multiply by 1 over b square and here we'll multiply by 1 over b square so it will be 6a square over b square this and this so it will be 6a square over b square then minus 13ab divided by b square it will be 13a this b will cancel this square so it will be a over b then plus 6b square divided by b square it will be 6 is equal to 0 times 1 over b square it is 0 then from here it will be 6 a square over b square to be a over b then bracket square then minus 13 a over b then plus 6 is equal to 0 now here it is in the form of a quadratic equation where quadratic equation in form of a over b a over b now to find the values of a over b we will use quadratic formula so to find the values of a over b is equal to here it, from the quadratic formula it is minus b plus or minus square root of b square minus 4ab then over 2a so it will be a over b is equal to minus b b it is negative 13 so it will be bracket negative 13 bracket plus or minus square root of b square it will be this minus 13 bracket square then minus 4 times a a is 6 times b b is 6 then over 2 times a a is 6 so it will be a over b is equal to minus minus 13 to be positive 13 plus or minus square root of minus 13 square to be positive 13 square is 169 then minus 4 times 6 is 24 24 times 6 4 times 6 is 24 goes to 6 times 2 is 12 12 plus 2 is 14 so to be minus 144 then over this time this is 12 then it will be a over b is equal to 13 plus or minus square root of this minus this 9 minus 4 is 5 16 minus 14 is 2 then over this 12 so it will be a over b is equal to 13 plus or minus square root of 25 is 5 then over 12 now here we have two solutions of a over b so the first solution of a over b is equal to 13 plus 5 is 18 18 divided by 12 now to simplify here divide by 6 18 divided by 6 is 3 12 divided by 6 is 2 so it will be 3 over 2 the first value of a over b and here the value of a over b the second solution when this is negative to be 13 minus 5 13 minus 5 is 8 over this 12 then 8 divided by 4 is 
2. 12 divided by 4 is 3, so 2 over 3. Then from here we'll recall, before we let a and b, a it is 2 power of x and b is 3 power of x. So it will be a is 2 power of x over b is 3 power of x is equal to 3 over 2. Now from here power of x is common, so it will be 2 over 3, then bracket this power of x which is common is equal to here it is 2 over 3, this 3 over 2, so we'll take the reciprocal. So it will be 2 over 3, then bracket power of negative 1. So from here, we have same base of 2 over 3, so we'll compare these powers. So it will be x is equal to negative 1. So this is the first solution for the value of x. And from here, a over b, a, a it is 2 power of x, over b is 3 power of x, is equal to... 2 over 3. Now from here power of x is common, so it will be 2 over 3. Then bracket power of x which is common is equal to 2 over 3. Now from here 2 over 3, 2 over 3. This is same as power of 1. So same base, so we'll compare these powers. So it will be x is equal to 1. So from these two solutions, x is equal to 1, x is equal to negative 1. Therefore, our conclusion, x is equal to plus or minus 1. So this is our final answer. Thank you for watching. Don't forget these steps to miss out. Subscribe to my channel and see you in the next video. Bye bye.